Today we are at Butte College hosting the third annual Men and Child Care Conference. We bring together teachers, students, and community members to talk about what are the challenges for men in the field and how we can recruit more male teachers. About 95% of the teachers in the early childhood field are women. Children need to see diversity. They need to see different ways of being a boy, different ways of being a girl, in all of the varied ways we express gender. There's really not enough men in, in the field of social work or social services. Uh, it's heavily uh, female dominated, which is not a bad thing, but there's a tendency to um, be, feel maybe sometimes feel more comfortable, more at ease meeting with people, speaking with people, or going to groups with uh, people that look like you, or talk like you, or, or think like you as well. The joy of this conference is to see this many men gathered in one place, talking about things that are meaningful to them, and just be revitalized and rejuvenated by, by meeting others that are like-minded and have the same goals for, for children. Well, the favorite thing about this conference is learning leadership and building a connection with others and being sure that you empower yourself to stay strong. Well, I am a man in childcare and so it, it kind of uh, just clicked with me and um, I wasn't expecting uh, it to be exactly focused on what it is and so it's, it's uh, kind of opened my eyes to uh, how, what an impact uh, we can have on a uh, child in this, uh, in this world today. And I'm here because I had a number of individuals, educators, and mentors who challenged the idea of what it meant for me to be a normal learner. And many of those mentors, individuals, and teachers in my life who put me on a different path were men. They were few and far between in the educational environments that I found myself in, but they were overrepresented in my story of change, in people who made a difference for me. Male teachers and folks that are concerned about having more male teachers in the field often don't have the space, certainly not a conference, to have these deeply important conversations. We've learned the value of bringing folks together and really strategizing how we can do things how we can serve young children better.